Yo, what is up everybody and welcome to our Man 13 online game. Today we got the Cincinnati Bengals and the New York Giants. And we got Addy Cards in the building. Top 100 player in the Man 13 leaderboards. Oh. And more importantly, YouTube commentary that a lot of you guys know is over 6,000 subs. Really cool dude. And we got a game in here. And right now he is thoroughly kicking my butt. About to go 14 nothing. We fumbled our first offensive snap in the game, which really blew. And now we can't do anything. Third down and three. We try to throw it to David Wilson. We get nothing. Fourth down and one. We need this to have a chance in this game. And Addy makes a stop, almost comes up with the pick. And now, this is about to turn into the funeral of Cookie Boy 17 here. This is going to be a complete blowout by Addy. But then Corey Webster comes up with a huge pick here. Gets a decent return, almost took it all the way back. But we needed this because he was in field goal range, had a chance to go up 17 0, a three possession game. Instead, we come back on the other end and make it a 14 7 game. And we can get some defensive stops right back in the game all of a sudden. And that's exactly what we do. Fourth down and 23, Corey Webster comes up again another decent return on the pick and we get the ball at the 19 already and it only takes us one play to get Hakeem Nix's second receiving touchdown in the game and it's tied up just like that. Here, third down and 15. Addy nowhere to go. Takes a sack and ends up taking his field goal, which is something you know Addy doesn't do often. But yeah, we're in this game for sure now. Here, a nice little drag after Victor Cruz ends up being a salsa in the end zone thanks to the beautiful block by Akeem Nix. And Cruz has enough speed to go all the way in. And that's the halftime score, 21 to 17. And after he can't convert this on his first drive to third quarter, he kicks a field goal. We're still up. Unfortunately, Addy makes the stop here and third down 11. I try to hit up Cruz, but Leon Hall makes a great play on the ball. And then Addy in the end zone for a touchdown. He redeems himself after blowing the lead and all that, letting me go up 21 to 17. But he can't get the two point conversion. And in only two plays, Victor Cruz in coverage comes down with it. And that's a 76 yard go ahead touchdown. And we get the two point conversion. Yes, a three point game, a field goal game with 5.52 left. And now it's all up on Addy. We've been playing some pretty good defense on him, we got quite a few stops. And we can get one more. We're golden. Fourth down and 14. That was a heartbreaker to give up. He got that one. But third down and five. We could do something. Come on, defense. Oh, man. Big hit. But he gets the first down. 332. You can see the clock is ticking. And it's ticking on Addy. Because on third down and 22, we get the SWAT. Fourth down and 22. This is the game here. If he can't get it in, he gets it. I don't know how Amukamar didn't make the play. But Addy pulls a miracle out. And now with a chance to win the game. Under two minutes left now. The clock is completely milked on me. Addy's going to get this touchdown with no time left. Big time first down to third down and nine. One minute and nine seconds left now. He's running the ball consistently. Second down and five. We make a big time stop here. Stop here. I think Tuck made the stop. Third down and seven. Look at that clock. Three, two, balls in the air. Can he catch it? He drops it. And if he caught it. We could have potentially, like, let him run out the rest of the clock, and he wouldn't get any playoff. Instead, he gets the field goal, and we go to overtime. Addy played that really conservatively. Why? Because thanks to the coin toss glitch, Addy gets the ball. He receives it, and a touchdown wins the game for Addy. It could be a heartbreaker for us after we came down. Hopefully, we can get one more defensive stop, but Addy is a tough opponent. Second down 11, FL screen. Thankfully, we cage that up. Third down and seven. Addy goes to the out route, and he doesn't get the first down. It's fourth down in inches, and now Addy... Only inches though, so this is easy to get, right? So we pinch the line, we commit to the quarterback run, and we stop him! Wow, Chase Blackburn shot the gap. The white man can fly, and he makes us the stop. Second down and 11, we're going to take our field goal to win, and he tries to block it, but he can't, and we make it, and we win the game. Wow, I hope you guys like this video, and wow, what a game. This is Mark Bartprince from here, and I'm freaking excited! I'm bringing you the highlights of the first round of Tyler Malani's Dunk Tournament. 16 competitors competing in five rounds to find the ultimate NBA dunker. Here's Kevin the Tarantula with his first dunk! Diddy, dude, a day! Slams it! Damn! I'm absolutely drowning in jizz out here in the studio. You're just lucky you can't see me in my sticky face. Iggy the Piggy slamming it! Damn it! Nate Robinson here, all three foot nine of him, BAM! 
360. What a teammate. DeAndre Jordan must be the most retarded player in the NBA. Just copies. Kevin Durant. Kevin Durant comes back and says, yo, this is how you do it. What's wrong with you, bro? Los Angeles snake. The Iggy the Piggy says, look what I got in the bank. Money. So much money. Cash. Nate Robinson comes back from the Shire. What a hobbit. I'm not trying to say he's small, but he's definitely from Lord of the Rings and definitely has hair on his feet. KD comes back, last dunk of his round. 360 with the windmill. I think he's cheating. You can't pound the ball like that. Iguodala comes back with one of the most crazy dunks I've ever seen in my life. Bam! Wait. Bam again. Double dunk. This ain't NBA Street home court. Or is it? Damn. Nate Robinson comes back again. So damn small. Bam! 360 through the legs. Going reverse style. DeAndre Jordan comes back with actually something unique. He jumps over four players. Not copying Kevin Durant. He'll never be Kevin Durant. Seven foot homo. But it's Andre Godala who wins it. He goes through to the championship round, and we'll see you next time in round two. I've been Mark Bachmanstrom. Thank you. Subscribe if you're cool.